It's time for another lottery card hunt, everyone. We've got two of every pack that might have a masterpiece, an invention, or an invocation lottery card. So let's get into it. Battle for Zendikar. Um, I have already found the expedition out of this particular box of Battle for Zendikar, so kind of unlikely. Uh, that I'll be getting another one, so it's been requested that I do these ones first, since it's potentially a bit of a dead draw. We got a Mirasa Ranger, a Resolute Blade Master, Hedron Archives, good uncommon, and a Philidar Sovereign, Cat Beast, Vigilance, Lifelink, does some stuff. Full Art Planes and a Knight Ally, and no Expedition. Sure. So, here we go. How's everyone doing today? If you're doing well, toss me a like on this video. Let me know what you think down below about Battle for Zendikar. Just kind of flipping through those comments quickly. Drawn Emissary, Fire Mantle Mage, Pilgrim's Eye, and Aligned Hedron Network. Exile some creatures. There we go. Kaladesh up next. Looking for an e a invention. These ones are inventions, right? So cool style. Two with Aether, pretty good common. Die Young, unfortunate. Weapon craft enthusiast servo exhibition. Sequestered stash. Toolcraft exemplar. Dwarf artificer. Nothing extra there. I'll do those there. Next up, we're just burning through these. Get some grubs. Get some courage. Got impeccable timing. Blossoming defense. Consulate surveillance. Armorcraft judge. Concealed courtyard. White and black. And there's Belfield Tavern. Unless you control two or fewer other lands. That's solid. Nothing extra there. One second. Some stuff happening over here on the side. Amiket. You guys say Amonket or Amonket? I kind of have gone back and forth. I like the Egyptian style. Some mummies, nagas, and stuff. Oh, we got a foil. I'm pretty bad at spoiling these, as you've seen in the past. Synchronized Strike, Decimator Beetle. Nissa, Steward of Elements, very nice. Excellent Planeswalker Mythic. And a Prepare to Fight for the Foil, Foil Rare, that's decent. There we go. Next up, come on. Let's hit the lottery here. Cartouche. Cats, Mummies, Nagas, Curses, fun stuff. Gate to the Afterlife, Avon Wind Guide, Trial of Solidarity, and a Canyon Slough, Cycling Land, and nothing else than that. Oath of the G for me and the Flame Seeker Negate. Embodiment of Fury. Nissa's Judgment, Reflector Mage, Solid, and a Matter Reshaper. Two in a color list for an Eldrazi. And a Full Art. There it is. Brute Strength. Shrieker. Envoy. Spatial Contortion. Flare Drone. Stoneforge Acolyte. Ooh, Kozilek. The Great Distortion, 8 and 2 colorless, 12, 12, Legendary Eldrazi. When you cast Kozilek, the Great Distortion, if you have fewer than 7 cards in hand, draw cards equal to the difference. It's got Menace. Discard a card with converted mana cost X. Counter target spell with converted mana cost X. It's pretty decent, i got to say. I will be scanning that one up here shortly to see the total of my packs here. Aether Revolt up next. In the Brights, Druid, 
Some filigree dudes. Oh, we got two filigree crawlers in the common section. I don't see that too often. I'm usually pretty good about the, uh, the randomization. Restoration specialist pacifi pacification array. Say that five times fast. Sly requisitioner and a Rishkar's expertise. Draw cards equal to the greatest power among creatures you control for six. And some other stuff that I didn't read, obviously. Eighth, uh, yep, another Aether Revolt. Another foil at the end. Didn't look like anything too ba crazy. We got a Daredevil Dragster, Foundry Hornet, Consulate Dreadnought, and Sram's Expertise. Create some servo tokens. Cast a card, convert a mana, cost three or less from your hand without paying a card cost. Fine. Bastion Inventor is a foil and a servo. I'm like swimming in servo and thopter tokens from my random buys. I don't need any more. Our Devastation, you're my only hope. Let's get lucky here. Aerial Guide, some Venom. Some deserts, Ruin Rat, a Cursed Horde, Magma Roth, Obelisk Spider, I like this card, and Frank Sanity. It's an Aura Curse, Enchant Player, at the beginning of each end step, Enchant Player puts the top X cards in his library, from his library into his graveyard, where X is the number of cards put into that graveyard from anywhere this turn. Might see a little play, hey, a Foil of Braid, that's pretty decent as well. And a Punch Token. Uh, I'm going to put that with the golds. There we go. One last pack, and then we will scan these up. Let's see how I did. The Act of Heroism. Sandwalla. Crypt of the Eternals. Accursed Horde. Overcome. Ramanap Excavator. Naga Cleric. You may play land cards from your graveyard. I think that's pretty useful. Jeru's Renunciation in Foil. And that is it. Alright. Scan them. Alright. Let's get these rares. Whoops. Connect. Yep. 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 Got problems here. Okay. Got the excavator. Wow, twelve ninety nine. Like I said, it's pretty good. Got a foil of braid. Switch it to foil. Yeah, five eighty three. Frank sanity. Six bucks. Hey, pulled some decent stuff out of our. Srams, not so much. Rich cars. Six bucks there. Hey, got a matter reshaper. Couple bucks there. Canyon slough. Couple bucks there, hey. Got a prepare to fight in foil. Just sixty cents. A concealed courtyard. Three bucks. Pioneer is uh, driving these prices, I imagine. Hedron Network. A little bit there. Philidar Sovereign. That's a buck. Here we go. Nissa Steward of Elements. Buck and Kozilek, twelve dollars. Hey, fifty-five bucks out of my twelve packs there. Thanks for stopping by and hanging out with me, Tragic MTG. See you later.